What is up, guys? This is Pinzo back with another video today, and what I have for you guys is some Quang. Quang is getting buffed in the next patch, and he is already really good. This is one of the games where you're playing solo lane. I think that this is a pretty bad matchup for Quang, but it's navigatable if you know how to play it. Uh, I think time warp first item into Grux is the way to go. It gives you really low cooldown so that you can Q, RMB, poke him a lot. And then if you get a Grux to about 60% HP, you know, maybe 70%, you can you win an all in at that point, right? At, once he's poked out, then you can go in and win fights against him. So hopefully you guys enjoy. If you do, leave a like, comment, subscribe, but we'll jump right into it. Also, Quang's getting giga buffed in next patch, just by the way. I already think this character is good and he's getting fucking giga buffed. Fine. I'm never really going to out clear a Grux, so I'll take the minions. I'll get a little poke. I'll walk away. Fine with me. I'm on strong side anyway, so if he really wants to step up, he can step up. Started Q. Interesting. I missed. Don't worry about it. I think Q start on Grux is only good into Zeris. Legitimately the only character that I would start Q into. I don't know, man. Like, taking the CC abilities first is fine in some matchups, but I don't think Quang is one of those matchups. Like, he, I think he should just have run at me at level 1, to be honest. Takes RMB level 1, and he just walks at me, and I die. Like, his RMB is way better than my RMB at level 1. I'll take it. I should get green buff here as well. Level 1 CC for Zeris. Well, I, again, I think you can take Q at level 1. Grux Q at level 1 against Zeris. Because he outranges you so hard. That I think you can take... Uh, if you take your pull at level 1 on Grux, it lets you play more aggressive against him. Is this a remix of this song? Is this like a is this a fucking cover? What is this? What are we listening to? Oh no, this is a different song. I thought that I did, I did not know what song this was. Oh, that's kind of bad. I mean, this guy got forced. He he I he back he had to back at a really bad time. So 
His lane is a little bit boned at the moment. Once he hits six, he'll be fine, but taking another bad back. I mean, I'll walk at this guy to try and keep him off of this wave. him for damage honestly i'm six and he's not i'll just like my ult actually does decent damage at level six so i'll just press r honestly if i had mana i'd kill him oh it's actually a good pull if i had mana i would i'd kill him now he's six I do have to leave. <laughs> he uh, he does get to he does run me down there if I don't walk away. So I actually have to play that kind of safe. But okay, a little awkward. Yeah, this is a mashup. So I thought I was like, this is not the song I thought it was. But then it wasn't, then it just straight up wasn't the song that I thought it was. But it is. Just, uh, it's just a combo song. Do you think Quang passive? Like, stacking crest and acting as an ability is intended. I know they removed the mutilator interaction in the patch notes, but do you think they're going to remove the crest interaction? I can unleash the heaven's fury. What's he building? Going Draconum first? Judgment. Why is he going Draconum against, uh, against Quang? Like, I don't think that's a very good first item, period, but this is the matchup you're going to try it into? I don't know, man. Like, he could just go Absolution. That'd be fine. Wouldn't be super awesome, I don't think, but... I missed all my minions there. Right there. Fine. I have all my mana regen, so I'm not like I can kind of just keep spamming. Got a actually got a lot of mana regen right now. So it's actually really hard for him to play this lane. But I'm ahead, it gets really difficult for him to play this lane. He does not want to be behind the Quang in this lane. I'll be right back. I have crest. Nine minute crest. I think I'm just gonna go obelisk. I don't know. Tempest would bang this game. Nah, I'm going obelisk. Tempest would be really good though. Sorry, right, I'm fixing I'm fixing the, the song cue. I'm fixing it, don't worry. It's going. It's going. Wow, 
What is this? Okay, my ult didn't even start, but it got cancelled. Alright. This is a weird musical version of this song, but okay. I didn't even obelisk her. I, I obelisked after my auto hit and she still just died to it. I auto please, thank you. Alright, I'm skipping this. Alright, that's just not that's not the vibe. She really blinked on me? Uh, yeah, she did. <laughs> she really thought that uh, she could blink R&B ult me and I would die. Like, bro, I have this really cool thing called a shield that is really good. There's a storm brewing. <clears throat> Music still playing? Yeah. Yep. Music is a go. He was waiting for me. Oh. <laughs> oh, he has an orange buff. I don't want to fight him while he has orange buff. I don't want to fight him while he has an orange buff. It's a lot of extra damage that he gets for free. Are we to see the Q? I don't know. I don't think so. I don't think so. I'm not sure, but I don't think so. He's so he's so scared of my tether, bro. I know that the Greystone's coming. Is passive blocking my auto there? I actually think saves his life. I actually think his passive blocking my auto might have just saved his life. Because I didn't get the auto on him while he was knocked up. It's actually crazy. Crazy lucky. Grabbing some supplies. The music should be the same volume as the normal music I play on stream, man. It has the same filter on it. it. has the exact same noise gate on it. Like, it's not... It should be the exact same. Ally tower under attack. Can't hear shit? That sounds like a you Ally issue, Anthony. Everyone, everyone else can hear it, bro, so I don't know what to tell you. My gadget lived the gank in mid. That's actually pretty big. I mean, I'm two levels up on this guy now. And I know, and he has no flash. His flash is on my timer, so. Guy uh, doesn't get to really play anymore.
It's all right. I got the smalls. Small ones matter too, man. Two smalls for a big. I'll take it. Fine. I got my Amir now. Just going to ping on my way. I'm coming to this Fangtooth. Now they know I'm here. Skill Bell. She can go back in for that. That's, that's kind of whatever. She just walked back into Rift Walkers and die. I mean, you know, I, 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 I fucking send it, I guess. Send it, my guy. You win, you win those. I promise. You win those. I lose a tier one. I knew I was going to lose that tier one. It's kind of whatever. I got two kills. way too early bad obelisk it's okay he's gonna check his camps hello graystone okay you're drunk you're never ever catching me bro <laughs> what what was that he's never he never ever catches me and i'm pretty sure i win the 1v1 even if he does catch me so Steel's fighting. I'm going to have to follow him. Right I missed. I missed my tether. I, I, think I, I think I could have tethered him and then waited for the Phoenix to fall off and then RMB'd him. I don't know if I had that much time, but I think I did. How world stream when? Good question. Good question. Our world's crazy fun, bro. That game is that game's sick. Bro, I'm huge. I'm fucking level 13. Five levels up on their carry. Like, I should be levels up on their carry, but five? A decent amount. Doing all the damage that I can to this. Got it. Big. Get a stack of obelisk when you kill an enemy hero when you activate it. You don't have to get the kill. They just have to die within like three seconds of act of hitting them with it. Same with minions. You don't have to... Your, your obelisk doesn't have to get the last hit. But if they die within like three seconds of you obelisking them, then uh, you get the stack. Yeah, same goes for enemy heroes, towers, prime, fangtooth. Anything you obelisk that dies afterwards. With Again, I think it's three seconds. Yeah. Uh, you get the stack. I'll be right back. 
turrets. Yeah, you can stack off of towers. You can stack off of prime. I don't think you can stack off of Iggy turrets, but uh, you can stack off of yeah, you can stack off of towers in Hibs. I don't know. I don't know if you can stack core. Not that it matters because the core would have to die, but. Well, Kenji used to get stacks whenever you got a killer and assist on an enemy hero. You used to just get a stack whenever you got a killer assist. You didn't have to activate it to get a stack off of heroes. It was just like, if they die, get your stacks. Good. Like, I just stacked off of that guy. Oh, I have an orange buff. I was like, why, is, why am I attacking so damn fast? How many stacks on obelisk is when it turns OP? Uh, about 10. <laughs> about 10. They nerfed it. Maybe it's, maybe it's 15. But obelisk is uh, very strong. Get a couple stacks on that bad boy, and that shit starts swinging. It also depends on how much power you have, because it does damage based. It does base damage based on how many stacks you have on it, but then it also does damage based on a uh, percent of your magic power. It has scaling per stack. We just got primal. Why are you ulting me? I'm fucking full HP. Did she think she had someone else marked, bro? What was that? Was awfully rude. My team kind of got wiped, <laughs> which is kind of bad. <laughs> I didn't realize they were losing. I probably should have been there. I also didn't realize it was primal. I probably should have been over there. I mean, it was a two for three. Isn't terrible, but me and Gadget have Primal, and we're the ones that matter with Primal, so pretty good. The Pope characters have Primal, baby. Oriult of all time, the 100% HP Morigesh ultimate, yeah. That was, in fact, one of the Morigesh ults of all time. She, she might think she wants the smoke, but she absolutely does not want the smoke. Like, I'm very confident that I one-shot that guy. He's also obelisk. He has no stasis. I'm very confident that I one-shot that guy. Why is our Murdoch on fucking three camp? Why is our Murdoch doing a three camp, bro? I mean, I am. Like, I'm taking it with Primal, but <laughs> don't really have any damage here. There's a Grux. I think we just have to full commit for this. Got it. Get shit on, idiot. That obelisk just hit that guy for a million. I just half hit that guy with an obelisk auto. I do have prime, but still, even with that, that's kind of ridiculous. That would be game jover for these guys. Obelisk stack off the tower, by the way.
And there's no way they can defend this. They cannot clear those. That's support Bellica. Even though she's full damage, she doesn't. She can't clear that. There's a storm brewing. Brex is dread proc. That twin blast is fucking dead. I'm dead. That was unfortunate. I didn't, I don't know. I, I kind of thought my steel was going to take aggro. I didn't realize how close I was. Oh, they just walked into a three-man fucking Brux knockup. Why is our Murdoch just AFK? Where is the music? is back. I mean, like, this guy's just kind of split pushing. I don't know. This guy's a little bit AFK. He's also Vanquisher Imperator on Murdoch. He's a, one of the builds of all time. I really want to buy full O-Crown here, but I don't think it's going to happen. Even if he gets that in here, but I don't have enough. Enemy killing spree. Yeah, I guess we just go to Fang. How much haste do I have? 65, not bad. I don't really want to be frontlining like I'm playing an assassin. No way, that missed her. Okay. I think I get a stack for killing that guy with his phoenix. For popping his phoenix. No, I didn't get a stack. I was at 24 already. Good to know. That'll be mine. That one's mine. That's a game. That's game Jover. I mean, game was already pretty Jover, but now nah, that's extra game Jover. I'll tank fire, I guess. I really want this blue buff. I'm gonna go grab it. Because I feel like it. Pink buff for me? What a what a what a what a guy. Assassin Quang pretty viable then. I like it. It's fun to play. I don't think it's like I, I don't think it's the best build on Quang, but it's very fun to play. Kinda <laughs> just dies, bro. <laughs> I should have ulted her. Oh, Murdoch got him. That guy has dread too? What the fuck? Bro, this enemy team has two dreads. <laughs> oh, I don't want to tank. Fuck. Ouch. Is that a Bellica bomb? That shit kind of hurt. She's double pen as, a, as she's triple pen as support, bro. Okay, I one shot her. Like that. Ugh. 
yeah, that like that Quang build, that uh, the assassin kind of Quang build is it's way fun. I don't think it's like realistically like at a competitive level. I don't think it's the best way to build him. I think Bruiser Quang is really really good and it gets better next patch. So yeah, we'll see. But this like assassin Quang is really fun to play. I mean, I literally I could one shot their carry, I could one shot their mid laner, and I could one shot their support. If I if I hit a tether, they die. If I hit them with a Q, they die.